Welcome to a video from the digitallifestyle.com. This video we're going to have a look at the new build of Windows 10. This is build 14936 for Windows Insiders on the fast ring. Not a lot of changes in this build. This is a Redstone 2 build. Um, Microsoft's still working to add new features, but we're not really seeing any uh, new features at the moment. There are a couple of things that they call out in the blog post that uh, they'll show you as well. Um, the thing that the first thing they call out is actually there's a couple of new extensions and this is one of them, this is a third party one called Turn Off The Lights. So you go to watch a YouTube video like that and you hit the Turn Off The Lights button and it dims the screen just leaving the video highlighted which is a, quite a nice little add-in. I think it's been available for the browsers in the past. Um, but that's good to see. So that's the one they also talk about. Uh, Tampa Monkey, which is a user script manager for sort of developers and a personal shopping assistant. So, not a huge amount of, uh, with that. There is a couple of things that they do call out. They mention that on the um, that after you connect to NAS or home servers or file servers, you you may find that your network's disappeared and you've got to change it from private to enterprise or enterprise to private. And uh, I don't think I can really show that because I've not got lots on this network here. And uh, but if I did, then you can change those map drives. So I think let's uh, have a look. So you can see there, uh, that's working fine. But you can change your network location, um, and they have a, a, a link on that, which I'll include with the uh, the blog post on the digitallifestyle.com. Um, they've updated the Ubuntu version to 1604. Uh, instead of 14.04 and then other changes are they fix narrator issues with uh, Groove Music which is good uh, they fixed issues where using the tab key to navigate through settings wouldn't work and um, that does work now well it switches between there let's let's have a see if it does kind of I guess um, you can use the tab key like that um, and they've fixed an issue with that stops in explorer.e crashing particularly on those with multiple network switches I don't think I've seen that on on here there are just a few known issues uh, some optional co components not to may not work you've got to go into turn Windows features on and off and sort of disable them and re-enable them and the components will come back and uh, there's a uh, Tencent apps may cause your PC to blue screen and running SFC for so scan now in elevated command prompt may fail at 20%. That SFC is got system file checker you can use to check that everything's running okay. So don't try it on these builds or you can try it but it, you'll get those errors. So like I said not a huge amount to look at here with 1.4 936 uh, it's um there's not there's not a huge amount of changes new extension builds but uh, that's available for anything you don't actually have to be on the um inside a program to to get that but anyway that's the changes thanks for watching this video i do have a video looking at the mobile changes as well and you can see more on the just lifestyle.com